Hello and welcome to another voice over of Stalement. In this segment, we will be delving into the recent decline in India's manganese ore imports during the first top up calendar year 2023. According to data maintained by Stalement, India's manganese ore imports for all grades witnessed a significant drop of 33%, amounting to 2.3 million tons compared to the 3.4 million tons recorded in the preceding year. During H1CY23, despite a stable manganese ore consumption in India, the global ore supply decreased, primarily due to decline in production from major exporters such as South Africa and Gabon. The impact of reduced production in these countries significantly affected India's imports volumes. So let's have a quick look on the factors weighing down imports. South Africa remained the largest exporter of manganese ore to India during H1CY23. However, export volumes saw a drop of 20% on a year-on-year -year basis, decreasing from 1.84 million tons in H1CY22 to 1.47 million tons in H1CY23. The challenges faced by the South African manganese mining industries, including poor economic growth, high input costs, and inadequate rail and port capacity for exports contributed to this decline. Gabon, another significant exporter of manganese ore to India, also experienced a substantial decrease in export volumes. The volumes dropped by 45% in H1CY23, declining from 1.11 million tons in H1CY22 to 0.61 million tons in H1CY23. This reduction was mainly attributed to a first major incident that impacted major minor era mains production in Gabon, leading to a 38% drop in the first quarter. Australia's manganese ore exports to India experienced a significant decline, falling by 62% year on year, dropping from 0.37 million tons in H1CY22 to 0.15 million tons in H1CY23. The sharp decrease in exports was primarily due to almost negligible imports from Australia in March, April and May 2023. This drop in demand can be attributed to under-pressure manganese alloys market, aligning with bearish steel sentiments, resulting in reduced demand for manganese ore. In addition to the global scenario, factors within the domestic market also contributed to the reduction in India's manganese ore imports. Moil, an Indian state-owned manganese ore producer, reported an increase of 20% in manganese ore production and a 19% increase in sales during H1CY23. This rise in moils production and sales may have reduced domestic bias interest in imported manganese ore. The price of manganese ore is typically adjusted based on supply and demand dynamics, particularly concerning alloy production forecasts and the marginal capacity of South African producers. With the current market scenario characterized by the bearish manganese alloys market, the lower steel demand, manganese alloys production has been curtailed in India, leading to a decreased demand for manganese ore. Moreover, some plants have switched or halted their production amid high electricity tariffs and sluggish manganese alloys demand at higher prices, further attributing to a lower manganese ore consumption in the latter half of the year. Additionally, the upcoming rainy season impacts on domestic production, especially moils production, may influence India's overall manganese ore imports in CY23. On global prospects basis, the challenges faced by South Africa's manganese mining industries are multifaceted with reduced ore exports being just one aspect. As the industry grapples with poor economic growth, rising input costs, and limited export capacity, some companies may struggle to stay operational. This situation has sparked discussion about possible merger and acquisition activity in the sector, with large companies potentially acquiring struggling mines to maintain production. For more updates, stay tuned to www.stillmain.com.